Hey guys, Bowser Character here. Welcome to part one of my playthrough of Digimon Your Digital Dream. Now, going into this, I have no idea what I'm getting myself into. I just know this is a Digimon hack of a Pokemon game. I love both series, so I am very excited to play this. And without further ado, let's begin. After the first meeting between humans and Digimon, all contact with the digital world had been lost. But last year, a company called Digital Dream found a way to open a gate to the digital world. With the help of scientists, Digital Dream began to travel to the digital world in search of new adventures. Today, on Digital Dream's first anniversary, they have launched a special contest called Your Digital Dream. The winners of the contest will have the chance to become a tamer and meet their Digimon. Hmm. So, selecting my gender, just like in the Pokemon games. Pretty sure the male design is from the first Digimon World game, because I remember that oh, um, little beanie hat. And of course, I'm going to choose male. Choose your character. I'm trying, damn it. Yes, male, thank you. So, are you sure? Yes. I just thought about it. I have no idea what the starter choices are. I'm gonna assume it's like Algamon, Gobblemon, etc. And of course, my name is Bao. Bao, prepare yourself to live great adventures. Will do. I'm guessing that's me. Looks kind of different, but okay. Pip, pip. Oh, it seems I received something. Let's go to see. Hey, it's a Digimon car on the table. Hmm, it's an email. Wow, it's from Digital Dream. Dear Bao, you have been chosen to participate in a special contest, Your Digital Dream. The contest will start tomorrow at 9 a.m. Yours, uh, yours sincerely, Digital Dream staff. This is amazing. I have to tell Kira about this. Someone's calling. Oh, or she could call me. Okay, so Kira is our childhood friend, I'm assuming. Okay, it's the female character we didn't pick. Hey, Bao, you're not going to believe this. I got picked for the Digital Dream Contest. Like, oh my god, me too. <laughs> I was going to tell you the same thing. I just thought about it. My character talks. That's different. Um, really, that's awesome. What would have been di different without you? I know, I'm so excited. I'll see you tomorrow. All right, Bao, later. Don't forget to set your alarm. Okay, so apparently it's night time, but looks like the um, sun is out from the window, so interesting. Click. I'm so excited to play this, you guys have no idea. Um, I don't know if I can sleep tonight, it would be awesome if we both win the contest. Well, going by the rules of plot, I'm sure you will. The next day, 8.54 a.m. Every time I hear the phrase, the next day, I think of, um, Hi, Hi, I'm Daisy's Persona 4 skit. Oh, I love that little comic. Oh no, I'm late. Damn, wake up calls. Gotta hurry. Okay, now I look more familiar. Well, I'm ready to go now. Don't forget the car on the table. Digital dream. This music. Now, there's so many I mean, wow, there's so many people here. I know, didn't think it would be so many. Was hoping we would be like the Digi Destin. <laughs> uh, I can tell they're fans. Yeah, me too. I'm going to be, it's going to be some tough competition. Welcome to the Digital Dream Center. My name is Lucy, and I'm the Tamer Assistant. If you need help, I am certainly capable of giving it. You must be Bao. Well, proceed, we'll, oh, well, proceed registering you. Okay, that's some interesting wording, but whatever. Registering. That's not a Digimon sound effect, but okay. Bao successfully registered. Now, your friend, you must be Kira, right? Registering. Kira successfully registered as well. Well, guys, now you have to wait for Sir Fish. Sir Fish? Like Phil Fish? He's the one making this all possible. Who is this? Our rival? So about you're here too. Didn't know they invited losers. Yep, that's our rival. Do you really expect to win? You don't have a chance. You're such a loser. Ah, ah, ah. Interesting laugh. What do you want from me, Thomas? Such a interesting name. Bao, Kira, and then you have this Western name, Thomas. You're always like this, even at school. Stop it, you guys. This isn't the time to act like idiots. Save for after the contest. Yeah, you're right, Kira. Whatever. See you later, loser. 
Okay, Gary Jr., calm your tits. Oh my god, there's black people in Digimon. And also Einstein, apparently. Welcome to the Digital Dream Center. I'm Dr. Fish. I'm sure Miss Lucy here has told you all about me. Today we want to give to some of you the chance to go to the digital world. But first, you have to win a special contest. Mm, Miss Lucy, will you give... Miss Lucy will give to you all the details. The luck to everyone. Ho ho ho. Thank you, Dr. Fish. Well, guys, the contest is divided in three steps. A test, digitalization, and meet your Digimon partner. Okay, the last two parts are available only for the contest winners. Okay, so how many of us are going to win? I'm going to assume three, and it's going to be me, Kira, and our rival, but let's see. So, guys, are you ready to start? Yes, I will win. I know this was a contest, but whatever. I don't want to take tests. Ugh. Memories of high school and college. Ugh. We're going to start, guys. Turn on the PC in front of you. More Pokemon sound effects in my Digimon. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, let's start the test. Now, I'll ask you a few questions about the digital world. Only a few of you will continue to the other parts of the special contest. So think well before deciding. Let's start. I think my voice just cracked. I don't know if the um, microphone picked that up or not. Question number one. Which of these is the correct Digivolution timeline or line? Uh, time to show off my mad Digimon knowledge. So, Rookie Champion Ultimate Mega, or if we're going by Japanese, Child, Adult, Perfect, and Ultimate. Correct. Next question. Betamon. It's Betamon. Correct. Bring it on. I'm good at this. Come on, come on. Third question, who is Ogremon's rival? Leomon. Make it too easy for me, come on. You're going very well. Question number four, TK's partner, Patamon. Correct. Last question. What is the digital written on the blackboard? Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't read Digimon. Let's see. Random guess, random educated guess. I'm going to assume it is Digital Monster. Ha ha, I did it! I mean, of course I knew that. Good job, guys. In a few, sec in a few seconds, we'll have the results. This is a fan um, hack, of course, so there's going to be typos and stuff. Also, I don't think I mentioned, but this hack isn't finished. How much is finished, I don't know, but I'm assuming there's like three gems or whatever they're called in this, so. The winners of the test are Thomas, Julie, Kira, Jasmine, Kenzo, Rio, and Bao. Congratulations to everyone. One of those other people will be like important to the plot later on. Hmm. Now the winners will follow us to the next room in which we'll start the digitalization process. Please go and put your data to initialize the digitalization process. Ooh. So close to the digital world. I'll go first. Of course, it's not the main character in this bitch. Please, before registering, tell me your account name. It's Bao. Okay, Bao, while the digitalization process loads you, loads, you have to answer a few questions. Which is your favorite Digimon series? Oh, I'm guessing this is how you pick your starter. Okay, so we have the choices of seasons 1, 2, 3, 4, and... Wait, 1, 2, 3. Oh, it's skip 4, Frontier. Okay, so it goes 5 and 6. Um... Do I want Vmon or Terriermon? Oh man, Flame Drummond is my favorite Digimon, but Terriermon is my second. Screw it, I'm going with Terriermon, if this is what I think it is. So Tamers, favorite color. Yep, because red would be Giomon, green is Terriermon, yellow is Renamon. So, give me that green! Okay, Bao, the digitalization process is almost complete. We'll call you when it's your turn to go to the digital world. Thank you, Miss Lucy. Digitalizing. Insert dial up sound here. The digitalization complete. You're tired of saying that word, honestly. What well, about now you can go to the Digi World? Have fun! Hope I will. I just finished, Val. Thanks for waiting. No problem. 
You are the last two. Please follow me. <clears throat> All right, let's go. Well, are you ready to go? Yes, of course. Then please step into the shining gate. Oh, oh, oh. And digitalization process. Kinda like we were trading Pokemon. Oh man, this music takes me back. The Digilab music. I can't remember which game this is from though. I wanna say World 2? I think this song is from Digimon World 2. I might be wrong. Transferring data complete. Welcome to the digital world. Please go to the other room. There you'll meet your Digimon. Thank you. So this is the digital world. Everything seems so real. That ain't Terriermon. I wonder if that's a custom sprite for Garchermon because I don't remember ever seeing that. Who are you? You must be my Digimon partner. Hell no, he ain't. I'm not your partner. Good. I'm Garchermon. I'm the guardian of the gate room. I see a Patamon down there. Oh, okay, my mistake. Oh, you're here. Oh, Miss Lucy is here too. Wow, are you my Digimon partner? Ah, uh, no, that's Garjamon, the protector of the gate. Come on, let's meet your true partners. Yes, finally. You two will become tamers. Tamers are people who fight with their Digimon to protect the digital world. This requires a lot of responsibility, remember that. Here's the Tamer Kit, it contains a Digivice and a Digimon Analyzer. Huh, I wonder which one is the Pokedex. 5 Digi Memory RS. Okay, so those must be the Pokeballs of this game. They can be used to store the data of, yep, they're the Pokeballs. They can be used to store the data of Digimon you find in the world. Now, I'm going to load the data of your Digimon partner. Show me the Terriamon. Actually, I wonder what she gets. And there he Oh, she got a Salamon. Not bad. I'm a big Angie One Mon fan. My Terrier Mon! Are you my Digimon partner? I am Terrier Mon. Nice to meet you. Bow with him, Terrier Mon. Would you like to give him a nickname? Yes, actually. Hmm, what am I gonna name you? Uh didn't think of this beforehand. Say a nickname for a bunny that shoots lasers and shit. Hmm. <laughs> uh, what's a good name for a bunny? Don't want to waste too much time on this. <laughs> See, Gargamon, Rapidmon, Mecha Gargamon, or whatever his name is. What would be good names for you? Hmm. Actually, I know what I'm going to be naming my Digimon. Like, all of them are going to be references to mechs. So your name will be Lancelot. Okay, so the last part doesn't fit, but Lancelot. If you get the reference, tell me in the comments saying you are awesome. You're not going to get any prize or anything. You're just freaking awesome for knowing the reference. And it's a mech, not Lancelot the figure from history. Now guys, let's test your tamer abilities. What do you mean? Uh oh, battle time. There's music. Mm, mm, mm. Tamer Kira would like to battle. Tamer Kira sent on Salomon. The hell is that? Okay, Sonic Jab and Growl. I'm guessing this is a normal move. Tuh, it has that Digimon cry from World 1. Okay, so Sonic Jab seems to be the tackle or scratch of this game. Critical, baby. And I think it's time to finish this. Nice walk, grew to level 6. 
No new attack, or... Nope. A very good battle indeed. Ha, and the Victory Fanfare is um, a remix of the opening theme from the first season of Digimon. Your Digimon are now located in your Digivices. You can call it by pressing Control. Hmm, okay. Good battle, guys. Now you're ready to go outside and meet other Digimon. If you need anything, our staff can give you that useful information. Before going, please register my phone number. Hey, girl. Call me. Good match, pal. Next time I'll win. Take my phone number before leaving. Okay, I'm getting all the girls' numbers. That's how Bal rolls. He used to call me Bal Bitches Sakaraga. See you later. Bye bye. Before we're going, please let me heal your Digimon. So, this place is the center, I'm assuming. Kind of makes sense. Thank you, Miss Lucy. I'll come back some other time. I'll be back, baby. Black people! Sorry, you cannot enter. Oh. Okay, is there a run button? Okay, there we go. In training, Digimon. Welcome to the digital world, human. This is a gift for you. Hawk Radish. What the hell does that do? Oh, I can push control to let Terrymon follow me or not. Awesome. Okay, that's my bag. Let me save. Are you sure you want to save now? Yes. This other file you guys are seeing is from not me, but the guy I got this from. But he only started in like one minute or something like that, so yeah. Um, Hi, Bao. We take care of these baby Digimon. They're so cute. Talk with your Digimon sometimes. Maybe we can find some items. Hmm, interesting. So, what you got for me? Whoa, Lancelot suddenly hugged Bao. Aw. Okay, so let's try to find some tall grass. And there's a Betamon under a waterfall here. Invisible walls and shit. Is this an item? Digi Mushroom. Oh yeah, that's what I was going to do. I was going to check what these items do. Okay, memory. Digi Memories are the Pokeballs. Digi Mushrooms are basically crappy potions. 10 HP. And Hawk Ratches are antidotes. Okay. Let's go to our options real quick. No, I don't want to save right now. Okay, attack speed is good, so let's continue our adventure. Show me the tall grass and a Digimon I like. Bit Forest, I remember this area very well. You a trainer? Hey, hello, you're a Tamer too, right? I use these Digi Memories to catch a Kunamon. But it escaped into the forest and now I can't find it. Would you help me find my Kunamon? Sure. Oh, this game has quest. Interesting. Thank you. I hope I'll see my Kunamon soon. Oh, this is the tall grass. Huh, Palmon. Well, I did have a crush on Lilymon as a kid, so I don't see why not. Hmm. Okay. Really? My first attack from someone that I get poisoned. Really? Uh, you probably won't survive another Sonic jab, so... Let's toss a Digi Memory R. Pokemon, I mean Digi Memory, go! That looks so awkward. It really does. If you don't stay in the damn memory. I might faint. This is not good. Okay, if it... You know what? No, I'm gonna hit it again. Okay, I'm gonna hit it again. Awesome. Okay, now it should stay in the freaking Digi-Memory. I keep wanting to say Pokeballs. Digi-Memory, go! I just noticed we have um, types. Like... Digimon types like vaccine and data. Yeah, Palmon join your party. What, no fanfare music? 
Palmon's a vegetarian Digimon. No, vegetation Digimon. During the day, it opens up the flower and spreads its leaf-like arms to perform photosynthesis. And it's a nature type, so I'm assuming that's grass in this game. Although I would expect Palmon to be grass and poison, but whatever. Would you like to give a nickname to Palmon? Yes. I will name you... Ah, uh, yes, I'm going with mech references. Uh, what's a floral type mech? I'm trying to think of the things from Gundam F91. Those little spinning blossom blades that, like, um, did genocide on, like, a colony. Uh, I'm trying not to remember. Hmm. Okay, I can't think of that, so let's think of something else. Palmon. The Palmon line is all plant based. Um, or pixie based. I'll name you Dunbine. Because Lilymon is sort of a pixie. And the Dunbine mechs are basically flying insect things. And let's get rid of this poison. So, Hawk Radish. It's a good thing I found this too. I would have been kind of screwed. Shall I try another Digimon? I think I shall. Uh, give me something good. Another Palmon. But experience is experience. Huh. Okay, I was wondering if this um, hack was touch screen, but it's not. So they kept rap from the Pokemon games. Unless Law is hurt by rap. <coughs> I like the fact there's a symbol in the corner to show I already have this Digimon. Yeah, I definitely gotta go back and heal after this. Show me level 7. Nope. Almost there. Hm. It's all Wormmon down there. Ooh, that's what I want, a Wormmon. I love Stingmon. And Wormmon's pretty awesome too. So, going back to Lucy. Did you miss me, baby? I know. Hmm. Don't recognize that jingle for the healing. We're back. Let's see. Probably going to end this episode in about somewhere from five to eight minutes. So I'm going to try and see what else is in here. Hmm, Kunamon. I wonder if this is a random Kunamon or it belongs to that dude. I actually really like Kunamon because it did evolve some to Kawagamon. And Kawagamon is awesome, Akuamon is awesome, and Grand Kawagamon is also awesome, so yeah. Hmm. So you have static. That's annoying. Where is our Digi memory? Toss that bad boy. Hopefully it stays in. Two, three. Oh, come on! Absorbing. Not absorb, absorbing. Hmm. You know what? I can still damage you further because I got Dunbine over here. Actually, it might be pronounced Dunbean. At least that's how it's pronounced in the intro to the show. Oh, come on! This is not a good start to this. Okay, Poison Claw. Interesting. That was a normal effect. It wasn't... Well, it was not not very effective, so... Very interesting. Could have poisoned it, you know. Obviously, I won't survive another attack, so let's try tossing this Digi memory at it. I need more of these, so now I'm down to one. And if this doesn't work, I'm running away, because I don't want to waste my last one on Kunamon, even though I like Kunamon. Okay, we're good. <clears throat> Kunamon's data was added to the Digimon Analyzer. Nature and Thunder. Okay. Kunamon is a larva Digimon with lightning patterns all over his body. His special move is an electrically charged thread of silk spit out from his hard beak. Cool. Would you like to give a nickname to Kunamon? Yes. 
Let's see, Kawagam Online, more insects. But these are really freaking terrifying insects. You know, this is kind of cheating, but hope this fits. Okay, there we go, Beetleborg. That counts as a mech. All my 90s kids should know that. And let's see if there's something we can use this last digi memory on. Ooh, worm on. I want it. I want it. You will be mine. Sonic Jab. Come on. Okay, perfect. Because I can hit it again. And you also have Poison Claw. But this time I'm not poisoned, so I'm good. Come on, Digi Memory. Do not fail me now. Come on. Come on. Daddy needs a worm on. I'm gonna say a worm pull. <laughs> oh, you so. <laughs> I wanted it. <sighs> okay. 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 I need more Digi Memories. And I'm coming back in this area for a worm on. Don't know if I'll do that off screen or on screen. I'm not gonna be playing like anything major off screen, but I might do to my um, leveling up and training off screen. Cause yeah, level 32 and I hit level seven. Bunny blast, nice. Oh, they drop items, awesome. I am loving it so far. And let's see what Bunny Blast does. Ah, he has a oh they have abilities inner focus overgrow and of course static bunny blast is a wind move huh space out shots of superheated air okay whatever also while i'm here user attacks to electric charge and lead to target with paralysis cool hmm. this is physical surprisingly the user drains the target's blood Wow. Okay, guys, so I'm going to stop here. So, not bad for our first episode. We have Terriermon, Lancelot the Terriermon, Dunbine the Palamon, and Beetleboard the Kunamon. Tune in for the next episode to see what we have next. And hopefully, I get some more Digi memories in that episode so I can come back and get my Wormmon. Also, I need to think of a nickname for that. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode as much as I did. I'm loving this game. Can't wait to play more. Thank you guys so much for watching and have a great day.